Hello and welcome to Rail Nation Day 9 So I'm actually recording this on day 10 However we are only about 4 hours into day 10 officially But I'm classing it as day 9 because Around this time is the time I normally service my trains at the moment i'd normally do them every sort of 24 hours uh that is simply to um reduce costs uh rather than keeping them fully fully done so for day nine updates we have all the trains now of a mole so as you might have remembered uh we used we did have donkeys um so we've gone past the falcon straight onto mole and now i'm getting onto a couplings um route wise i've still got a line going slightly past richington slightly heading down towards dory and we've not done much down the branton side just yet so we're still re pushing the um expensive goods as much as we can so I just need to quickly swap that out and just give a quick check on the yeah 40 grand yeah that's still gonna be paying so we are gonna service all the trains again if you don't have a plus account you'd be clicking on each train and press pressing the service for each train as i've got the plus account i just hit that hit that or we can decide to service all trains 82 percent and beyond or we can just service the trains there so we're just gonna service all the trains it's it's only 200 grand for all of them um, so just thinking a bit then we'll go and get some more research points not that I don't think we need them but just for the sake of a competition there um looks like i won't get any huh okay well we won't be getting any money it seems so we say screw that competition i think and we'll just keep on to this <coughs> Um, station buildings, um, I think is probably going to be the next one. So, pretty much everything is the same. Uh, might have done one more restaurant. I've definitely done one more lab since yesterday. Um, and I think everything pretty much is the same. Partly because we had to do the upgrade of the engines from the donkeys to the mole with all the upgrades so yesterday wasn't necessarily a good spending well it was a good spending day but unfortunately i've not had much money to do elsewhere so we're now looking at a 2.4 million for the next upgrade on the lab 
or 1.84e on the track I believe for now um, at least for the next day or two um, I think we're alright for the lab um, the era changes in four days well five days I guess um, so I think if I can knock out one more level on the lab before the end of the era I think I'll be actually pretty happy um, going into era 2 um, obviously the higher the better but I'm sort of thinking if I can just get you know maybe another upgrade because um, a lot of people tend to say as long as by era 1 you've got a level 10 lab so I'm kind of thinking let's try and push for a level 12 um, a little bit now something else that I'm gonna have to do ooh, what have I got building upgrade voucher is that a discount voucher in it I think instance what's a building upgrade voucher I'll have to check on that um, I definitely do not want to use it on that so but yeah, um, if I'm going to look at running passenger trains, I need to extend my station concourse a bit, um, obviously. So that isn't going to be the next project. Uh, let's see if I can work this out. Ah, uh, right, it is a discount okay so I do have a discount voucher that's why it's knocking 600 off so I think based on that uh, we definitely want to use it on one of these two buildings then I guess And that's just so that we can maximise the most out of it. So... Yes, that's what we're looking at. So I think for now... Uh, I think that's it for day 9. Uh, just a general update again um, and of course we'll keep looking at other options so thank you for watching please subscribe if you haven't done already uh, don't forget to drop a like and a comment below and thank you for watching bye bye